Hey guys, it's Angel B here and in today's video we're going to be looking at top 10 Minecraft mods of the month or of the week. Just ones that I have found that have recently been updated to 1.16.3. So before we get into this video, please be sure to subscribe if you aren't already. If you are enjoying my content, I do loads of mod reviews and I sometimes do a few other types of videos and I also stream on YouTube and Twitch. Links are in the description. So let's get right into it. So the first mod I want to show you is Ice and Fire. Now this is a 1.12.2 mod that got updated to 1.15 and 1.16 and it is a very intense large mod and for 1.16.3 I'm like what? How did they update it so quick? But it adds all types of creatures such as I'm going to show you the pixies first like this there you can capture them and have them in jars we need to be by the sea for this next one it adds a sea serpent which spawns in the sea not the river but in the sea it adds dragon nests which you find throughout the world or you can find them underground and when you do find them underground you get a tier 5 or tier 4 dragon and what you can do is you can kill it and it will drop an egg if it is a female and then you can hatch the egg and have your own dragons like these and you can ride them they are so cool because you can make them grow really large we have hippogriffs that you can also capture and get eggs for sirens which are in the oceans i swear when you need to find an ocean you can't find them it adds all these items right here. You can get dragon armor, all the different types of dragon eggs. You can get purple, white, blue, all types of different types. You can get loads of tools. There is death worms, which you can find out about those yourself. <laughs> this next mod is called Speedy Hoppers. Now this makes it so the hoppers are speedy. You can get different tiers, iron, diamond, and gold. Put it in and see how fast it's going into this chest. Same for the diamond, which is faster. So this next Minecraft mod is called Earth's Mobs. Now this adds some mobs from Minecraft Earth, such as the pig, but when you put the pig in mud, it likes the mud, go swimming in the mud, and it will develop muddy, a muddy pig texture. We have the click shroom, which is a chicken mushroom hybrid. We have the moo bloom, a horned sheep and the rainbow sheep which you can get rainbow carpet which is so cool this next one is called useful rail roads now this makes it so you, there is more rails in the game such as high speed oh it took the sheep this is a teleporter rail that you can teleport it adds these rails here which are crossover rails it adds direction rails and track builders which are really cool this next minecraft mod i want to show you is called doggy talents now this has been updated and this is quite a very popular mod it adds the dog food ball which i just accidentally broke a dog bird and dog water ball it adds some dog a doggy charm when you spawn it you'll get your own personal dog you take a stick you use the stick on it you can give him different levels you can level him up using training treats give him her name like this you can change his mode you can change his texture you can give him leather jacket sunglasses and you can like throw sticks and they will go and get it if you have them on the right mode yeah that is that mod this next mod is called spiders 2.0 i did show you this in a previous mod but i want more people to be aware of this especially this time of season it re-changes the animation of the spider to be a lot more um spooky <laughs> As you can see here, it does the same for cave spiders too. So this next mod called Random Loot Mod. Now when you kill creatures, you get items called different types of cases. You can get a basic case, which can give you basic weapons. Golden case will give you rare and titan case will give you, I think, ultra rare. And it basically just adds free textured weapons to the game with full different stats. As you can see here, there are so many different types. If we type in here the name of the mod, none of the items show up because there are so many different ones and it is all using the same ID. They're just different textures. 
So this next mod is called TV Posters. Now this, change, this adds some new paintings to the game. If we scroll through here, it will create some new paintings that are movie poster paintings. Here is another one. This one looks like Lost. TV show paintings. We have The Simpsons. And they are in the default Minecraft style too. You can just flick through all the paintings to try and find the ones you want. So this next mod I want to show you is, a lot of people ask me about this, so I'm going to show this on every video. This is Just Enough Items. This shows you all the recipes for everything in the game, including modded items. So this next mod is called Survive. Now this adds some hardcore mechanics to the game and very realistic, such as temperature, um, ham, such as temperature, sleep mechanics, stamina, thirst. You can create purified water bottle in order to get your thirst up. There is a canteen which you can fill up. You have water bowls, you have ice cubes if you're too hot to cool down. We have wool boots which will keep you warm. So this next Minecraft mod is called Night Terror. Now this brings a feature back in the original Minecraft from years and years ago where if you'd sleep, a random creature would spawn next to your bed. It's a rare chance of it happening. It doesn't happen every time. It will spawn a zombie or a creature right next to you if there's one nearby. So that is it for this mod review. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Please leave a like if you have and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Goodbye.